Hello, all you witches, wizards, and magical folks. I'm Katherine Hensler, the current executive director of the Protego Foundation. And I'm Brittany Drake, the current campaigns director for the Protego Foundation. For the past four and a half years, since summer of 2018, the Protego Foundation has been fighting to get Universal Studios Wizarding World and other official Wizarding World attractions around the world to offer a compassionate version of the iconic Wizarding World drink with our continuing campaign, Accio Vegan Butter Beer. People with dairy allergies and those who choose to abstain from dairy due to animal welfare and environmental concerns deserve to experience everything that the Wizarding World of Harry Potter has to offer, including its most popular themed drink. And most of all, mother and baby cows who were treated cruelly by the dairy industry deserve not to be exploited for this magical drink. Over 7,000 of you signed our original petition in the first phase of our campaign from 2018 to 2020. And when we launched the second phase of the campaign in 2021, 1,500 more of you signed the petition both in person and on our action alert page. And many of you even signed individual postcards to be sent to Universal Management, Hogwarts letter bombardment style. Our first win came in 2020 when it was announced that vegan bottled butter beer would be sold at Warner Brothers Studio Tour London. And then in 2021 came the amazing news that at the Harry Potter store in New York City, vegan butter beer would be offered in the US, both on tap, without the foam, and in bottled form. Some members of our team even made the journey to attend the opening of the store and were lucky enough to be among the first people to try vegan butter beer in the US. In 2022, just as we were about to embark on our first in-person protest outside Universal to continue to push for a compassionate version of the drink, and as we were promoting this campaign at LeakyCon Orlando, Universal surprised us all with a sudden announcement that yes, indeed, vegan butterbeer would finally be available by requesting no foam topping on both the cold and frozen forms of the beverage. And ultimately, just a few weeks ago, we were ecstatic to learn that at the Wizarding World Hollywood and Wizarding World Orlando, a brand new vegan foam topping could now be added to one's vegan butterbeer base for those cold and frozen versions, making a completely vegan butterbeer option at last a reality. From the very beginning of this campaign, we knew it was possible to get vegan butterbeer to happen. And it's truly thanks to all of you, the kind, compassionate fans, that we were able to make this change happen to help mother cows and their babies. From the bottom of our hearts, and from me personally, thank you. Thank you. However, our work here is not done. In the coming weeks and months, we will be pressuring the Wizarding Worlds in Japan and Beijing and the Warner Brothers Studio Tour Tokyo to make the same decision and offer fully vegan butterbeer, foam topping included. So if you haven't signed our petition yet, go to veganbutterbeer.com to make your voice heard. Once again, thank you so much for your support. We couldn't do what we do without all of you and the mother cows and their babies Thank you. Because all animals are magical. Protego, Protego Maxima. Maxima.